What's up, XRP family? I hope you guys are doing well. Let's dig in. We have some interesting stuff here. Transparency helps everyone. Transparency is our friend. Guys, we are getting closer than ever. The verdict on the lawsuit is almost here. We have to bear patient because it's almost time for XRP to actually move. Now listen, in 2017, it was exactly like this. It was very quiet before XRP blow off and went for a hundred thousand percent gain so do not lose hope because it's around the corner anything can happen let's see this quick video by um brett garlinghouse i'm excited to share with all of you that ripple has now processed nearly 30 billion dollars worth of volume since launch and over 20 million transactions since we first launched RippleNet years ago we're helping customers every step of the way to make sure their wallet has sufficient liquidity at all times for the smoothest possible experience. Over 10 years now, Ripple has been at the crux between enterprises and crypto native services, and we are doubling down on that. I hope it resonates with you in the same way it resonates with me. And this is crypto means business. Insane, right? 30 billion until now. That's actually nothing if you see what actually lays in front of us the trillions of dollars that they can actually manage so there is a very good future for ripple more footnotes ripple says that if the sec wants to suggest common enterprise means the entire xrp market it would need to show ripple manages controls and operates the, but the entire market i'm not lawyer but this sounds difficult this is very very difficult because this doesn't exist ripple is not controlling any market they don't have control over XRP market. They can, of course, they have a large portion of XRP and they can sell it, which will affect the market, but they do not control any XRP whatsoever. They do not have any nodes. They have nodes, but it's it's a very small amount uh, of nodes running on the XRP ledger. Always remember where you stand. This is how early you are, guys. And sometimes people really forget this. People really forget this, guys look at this people who have heard of crypto right it's the blue one look at that look how small people know about crypto it's it's nothing it's absolutely nothing and the thing is one day more people will have to understand crypto because they will have to use digital assets digital currencies so they will have to understand some kind of or hear of it you know people who have heard of xrp is even smaller and then the people who own crypto and then you have people who own xrp which is literally two dots on this whole pattern and then you have people who own more than 25k it's literally not even visible so this is how early you are never forget that maybe sometimes you look and it looks very obvious and easy as for xrp to go up. but listen no one knew that bitcoin was going to go up and a lot of people regret it afterwards right but now now everyone knows bitcoin and it's much easier but this is actually how many people really know crypto and xrp and who hold xrp it's very it's a very small amount guys and that is why you can be part of this wealth transfer if you're smart now this is the reply of ripple to the sec and i want to get into a, a last part here which is kind of interesting here you have a conclusion here they say fair enough, the sec has never offered clear guidance on when a digital asset is sufficiently decentralized to no longer constitute a security and based on its positions in this litigation appears to have abandoned the concept of decentralization entirely that the SEC's own amicus thinks the legal regime that applies is different from the one the SEC is applying here only shows that the SEC has created a hopeless confusion in this area that deprives Ripple <coughs> and other market participants of fair notice. In any event, even if accredifies tests of whether one or few centralized entities control 50% or more of the total issuance, of the asset where the governing law that would mean xrp has attained non-security status ripple today owns less than 50 percent of xrp what a timing guys what a timing this is recently by the way 
that XRP has less than 50% of XRP, right? This is recently, what a timing, right? Notwithstanding Ecodify's incorrect statements on the contrary, which are supported by no citations to any evidence. The recent decision in library also does not help the SEC with respect to fair notice. There, the court rejected the defendant's fair notice defense because it was nothing more than a bald claim without any supporting evidence behind it. This is actually concerning because if this is true, right, then how is it possible that the SEC won that case? Like, just think about that. That's something to worry about, right? Here, defendants have demonstrated an exacting detail supported by extensive evidence that market participants did not believe XRP was a security, that they lacked guidance as to what the law prohibited in this area, and the SEC knowingly injected further confusion into the marketplace through its contradictory guidance, all of which confirmed in any event that XRP should not be considered a solution. The court should grant defendants motion and should deny the sec's motion very interesting guys this looks very strong by by ripple and i think that the sec has absolutely no chance of winning this but hey you never know we will see anyway everything is planned guys and it's soon happening i said it on day one we will aggressively fight to get clear rules for the entire industry in the u.s Congrats to all team of Ripple for getting us to this point. Ripple stood strong and withstood the SEC's onslaught. I look forward to being on the right side of justice, right? So it's a matter of time, guys, before we get justice right now. Let me translate what Ripple, Ripple's GC is tactfully saying. In the two years that Ripple has defended itself versus the SEC, massive overreach with so much on the line. The Ripple team maintained a faithful allegiance to the law, something the judge had said herself. The SEC lacked. This is our final submission where we ask the court to grant judgment in our favor. After two long years, Ripple is proud of the defense we've mounted on behalf of the entire crypto industry. If Ripple gets clarity, guys, if Ripple wins, it's going to be crazy for crypto. Crypto is going to blow up because... It's a very different thing, right? Will Ripple win the SEC lawsuit? Roger first shares his thoughts on the outcome. Let's take a look at this video. Question for you. Do you think Ripple is going to win this? Yeah, I think Ripple will win. Mm -hmm. But uh, but if, if I can add to that, they'll win at the at the at the expense of you know maybe tens of millions of dollars, maybe a hundred million dollar plus spent on this. That's all money that they could have used to pay, you know, software engineers to build better tools to build on Ripple or better user interfaces or better wallets or or better, you know, user integrations with all these different things. So that's you know, maybe maybe a hundred million dollars of fees that went to not make the world a better place. And the world is that much less wealthy than it otherwise would have been. The world is poorer than it otherwise would have been. Fewer people have food to eat. More babies die at childbirth. Like the Bitcoin maximalists love to make fun of me for saying that. But if you look at the countries with the highest rate of you know GDP, more babies survive childbirth, right? So if you want more babies to survive childbirth, you want more economic freedom that leads to more economic growth. And more economic growth leads to more babies surviving childbirth. And the way to do that is not having to spend hundreds of millions of dollars fighting the, uh, the SEC uh, with stupid lawsuits. And uh, so I really would like to see a lot of that sort of thing come to, come to an end crazy he really goes extensive but he's right he's right this is actually absolutely useless fighting the sec over something that they did not clarify from the very beginning right which is really confusing i've been here for almost five years and the xrp sentiment was never lower very close to or worse than 2017 when price exploded by almost a hundred thousand percent i am ready now listen if XRP goes up a hundred thousand percent, guys, that will mean that we will see three digits, right? Because that's that's the chart. The charts never lie. The charts are always correct. News drives volatility, not direction. You have to understand that. If you look at the chart, the chart is pointing upwards. We have a massive impulse, a flag, and then the next impulse is up there. Ripple don't care about being known. Let's take a look. Use to, to come back full circle to the rail conversation we started with. Trains run all around the world. It works because the train company has manufactured a really good train. Then there's the seats within that train 
and that seat companies made really good seats for that service. They're all doing different things, but we don't think about the company that made the rails, right? So all of these things happen above ground. No one actually even knows who the company is, but it's doing it in the background. And I really think that's what Ripple's position will be. It won't be front facing until they have a bank and then be, that'll be a whole other element of it. But for the most part, I don't even think they care about being known because they know what they're doing. They're happy to be the rail holding up the train, holding up that whole other eco ecosystem that all the people are on. And we're happy holding the rails. <laughs> That's why we're excited. Exactly. We're excited. That's what we tell her. You just want to own the rails, right? At the end of the day, if you remember the builder, you know, the Vanderbilts, all them, they made their money making the rail, right? Or the guys yeah. who sold the picks in, which all the people going gold mining, right? You want to be the guy selling the picks, not the guy trying to dig for gold. Insane, guys. This is so spot on. This is so true, right? And that's it. R people don't know Ripple. People will not know that the CBDC is built on Ripple technology. People will not know that, guys. I just showed you how many people know about crypto, how many people own XRP. It's nothing, nothing compared to the whole world. So we are in a very good position, guys. Do not lose hope. You are closer than ever. Thank you very much for watching the video, guys. See you in the next one. Cheers.